Hi, I'm Debbie Pendergrast, Business Development Manager here at King Cut, and today I would like to show you how to successfully cut aluminium composite panelling using the right technique on your bench mounted smart fold or bench top Evolution 3 cutter using our new rocker head with the specialist Tech D012 blade. Firstly, you will need to take your specialist Tech D012 blade and your blade cartridge holder that comes with the rocker head and house it securely in place. We're going to be cutting three millimeter aluminium composite paneling. So for that, you need to adjust your blade so that it goes to the Mark IV on your sticker so that you have just enough blade showing to be able to actually pierce and go through the material itself. Once you have housed your blade, you then secure it into the rock head itself, securely doing up the silver screw in order to clamp the blade and the cartridge holder in place. Ensure that you place your rock head onto the heavy duty track so that it's smoothly gliding up and down the track. There's no friction and there's no resistance. Your aluminium composite panelling will come with plastic backing on both sides. Please ensure that you remove one of the backings to, to get a good cut. Securely clamp the ACP in place. You need to house it, if it's a smaller piece, you need to house it up to the right hand side of the machine securely placing it against the material stock so that there's no movement. You will also need, if you're doing this on a longer machine, you will also need a similar piece of material up against the left hand side of the machine in order to balance out the clamping bar itself. Securely clamp down the media in place. Face the right hand side of the machine Place one hand on the material and the other hand on the rocker head itself. I'm right-handed, but I personally prefer to use my left hand in order to cut. If you prefer, you can also house your left hand on the cut on the clamping system and the right hand on the rocker head tool. Hand positioning is very important. In order to get enough traction to go through the material, you need to place your upper body in a position you're not pushing through the legs. So Hold onto the material with one hand, place your left hand or your right hand on the rock head tool, far enough back that when you fully engage the head down, you get enough push and traction behind the head. Place your hand firmly back on the rocker head so that when it's fully engaged, you have a stable but firm push. Engage the blade. The first cut should be a smooth, Cut but firm to pierce the foil all the way along. The subsequent cuts should be a one motion, firm, strong strokes. It takes me four or five strokes to actually be able to cut all the way through the aluminium composite panelling you have a very nice finish. If you have any type of burring, you are able to take a, an abrasive pad and you can just sand down the edge. In preparation for printing or mounting. Make sure that you don't stop halfway through otherwise you may end up with the blade stuck into the material and it will disengage and unhouse from the blade holder itself. Please be mindful that this is not an all answering solution to cutting many sheets of aluminium composite panel on your bench mounted cutter. That's what the workhorse our steel track is for. It will give you a workable solution to cut from time to time some of the ACP. For more videos on how to's, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also follow us on social media on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook and LinkedIn. You can also find many more solutions and answers on our website 
www.keencut.com. Thanks for watching.